Welcome, Welcome to Random, Random Revolution. Revolution. I'm Pete. I'm Steel. I'm Steel. Turkish delight. Today is a taste test video, and we're here in our new studio. Yep. Turkish delight. Uh, if you remember, here, fine. Just, just got open to it. Um, Turkish delight. If you remember, in the scene of Narnia, where the dude like talks to the witch of him eating it and the little gremlin guy is like Turkish delight how did you do that i can make anything you like can you make me taller <laughs> anything you'd like to eat Turkish delight And you see him eat it. Um, this stuff is pretty hard to get your hands on unless you like go on the internet and search for it. You can't find this really just anywhere. Um, but yeah, this is one of my favorite desserts. And it's just simply because I rarely get it. And it's rose flavored. And I personally think that rose flavored things are good. Do you like rose flavored? I don't know that I've had a rose flavored thing. Without further ado, I'll let you open it up. Here's what it looks like on the inside. Yeah, so for those who have not had this before, it's a very subtle, light, refreshing flavor of rose. And if you don't know what rose is, just think of the, the flower. The smell of a rose, but then you're eating it. I give I you love a piece. This stuff. Give I you love a this delicious stuff. piece. I got this for us. Just smell it. Smell it. it. Smells like a rose, right? Yeah. Mhm. Mm smells like a rose. Mhm. Mm it's different. It is different. Very different from probably anything you've had. It's a very subtle flavor. I just don't know what to compare it to. The inside texture is of a myconite. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. It's kind of like a... Think of a myconite or a jelly bean without the shell. Yes, and that's what this is. It's the whole thing. And, and the really, powder... Really dusty. Is it? Ooh, you should do that. You should... So, it's like the color, this is what it looks like if you look off the powder. Wow, that's cool. I just, I love the the rose flavored stuff. It's a sweetened flowery taste. Like literally, just think of a rose and like as a flavor with sugar added. Would I get a whole bucket of these and just eat them? I would. He would. <laughs> I personally say have a few, put it away. You can have these for a while before they get old, I'm pretty sure. Um, the... So, no artificial flavors, sweeteners glucose free vegan food and gluten free so this all was fifteen dollars would you say that's a good price or a high price for this honestly well how long did it get to get here like how far was it like three days but the I got free shipping it's just the price of the thing I mean it's a very fancy um, uh, treat so I say fifteen bucks is not that bad, but that's just my opinion. Mm -hmm.